and welcome to another edition of Our Crazy Life. Um, Our Crazy Life. Uh, getting in sh- getting sh- in shape. Getting in shape. Um, yeah, that's what we're doing here. Yes, we're getting I, I, in shape. I, I, I'm off. I'm off. Um, before we go on, yes, all the kid cool kids say you need to beg. Yes, it does. For they subscribers and and shares and yes. likes, all the in the beginning of the podcast, right. not the end. So right now, I'm gonna we're gonna do our begging right now. Yes, if you like this. Share it. We have a few people doing it. We really appreciate it. Thank you. Uh, sharing it, liking it, and it, the more shares you get, obviously helps. But the likes help it moves it up in right. the algorithm. So there. like us, hit the thing. Something where Jack and I are trying to do our little YouTube channel. Yeah. And so we really, you know, would love your support. And uh, we like we like the support we're getting now. Yes, and it's we would great. love even more. So if you guys could take the time to, and you are obviously if you're doing it right now. We appreciate you taking the time, and we thank Wait, you. Wait, let me stop and do it right now. Hit subscribe, like. Okay, Jack, stop. Anyway, I think you can actually do it without stopping the video. Really? Yeah, it's right there. You just mm. click. I don't know. It's it's whatever. Anyway, that's what the cool kids said to do, so that's what we did. Um, so this week, this is the third week, week three of our, our quest what to get in shape. It? Yeah, it's the third week of getting in shape. So we've done two weeks. We started. It's week last three. Week was, no, week three is at the end of this week. This is the third episode of us. Yes, but in the shape. first episode is talking about it. Then we did a weigh-in. That was a week later. This is only this, this is the conclusion of the second week. We are starting our third week. Yes, Come on. you are correct. All right. It's not the conclusion of three weeks. No. So anyway. Our second week. Anyway. <laughs> I weighed myself, and I only lost two ounces. I was 184.8 last week. I'm 184.6 this week. Well, you know what, though? As much as you were eating their sweets and your Coke like that, you're lucky yeah, you're, I, I, you didn't gain any weight. I've fallen back in the soda thing. I, as, as, you know, there was a time I didn't drink any soda. Yeah, remember that? I went completely soda Cold, free yeah. for like a year. I yeah. Mean, I, my only thing is I said, well, I can put it in alcohol. If it has alcohol in it, I can have it. Yeah, you soda. can have that. But you, I think, what did you drink? Sprite or 7-Up or something? Instead? Sprite, 7-Up, or mostly water and stuff. I, I really I cut, forgot about that, I that really you did that. Cut, and I felt better. You did. But, you know. And we're not saying there's anything wrong with drinking soda and like that. No, it's just, just for it's you. Just for it me, the right it was the right for choice. It. Right. But um, anyway, so, but I, I do have a tip for people. I, uh, uh. A couple nights ago, I got a big bowl of Fritos. Which every night he brings big bowls of food up in the, no, up, I, in, it's, yes, it's not up in our night. room. And then I uh, I follow it with a bunch of jelly beans. Okay. So you had the Fritos with the jelly bean chasers. I'm gonna tell you right now, my stomach was like going, "Stupid, you're stupid." <laughs> I was I was in pain. I was like, I was trying to sleep that night, going, "Oh my god, what did I do?" <laughs> it's like that you kids won't remember this commercial. It used to be an Alpha Seltzer commercial where they go. I plop, can't plop. believe oh, I, I ate, ate the, the whole thing. thing. Yeah, remember that one? That's right. Now, we remember it. Look it up on YouTube. It's kind of funny. Maybe I'll post it on YouTube. I'll find it. I'll post it in our comment section. But, uh, yeah, so that was a mistake. But it's been a bad week for the... the but I did go on a walk today. You did walk today. I'm I very did, proud of I you. I said, well, I better go on a walk today because I don't want to gain weight. You were like... Today, all of a sudden, you were like... You didn't have... All, you only had one Coke, which was very good. No, I had two. But you did the, you did the second coat after you weighed in. Yes, yes. <laughs> after the weigh-in. And it reminds me of some of you people who are watching who were in the shows, or I was in the shows, where it was like that, in the ice, in the ice skating shows. Uh, you know, all the little things we used to do when we had our weekly weigh-ins, you know, you would do different things to make sure that you would weigh in what you were supposed to do. And when you were doing all the things you were doing, it reminded it's not me just, of that. It's not just a thing of weight. It's about feeling better because I, I did some work outside and... Not, and my back was. You know, we yeah, keep, I'm awake here. Now. People are going to subscribe. Why should I subscribe when she came to stay awake? What? <laughs> but now I was. It's the endurance because yes. I was doing some workouts. I was watching outside your... and I was just the pain. The pain it hurt the pain, but it wasn't right. just that. It was just the fact I was physically right. I was tired. Well, and I was worried because you know you are shaky, um, and <laughs> you had a, a, a. I do call myself Mr. Shaky. You do call yourself. He had, it's part of the the nerve damage that he has in his back, so he hands shake a lot like this. Um, so he was using a chainsaw. Hello, my baby. Hello, my baby. <laughs> so he was using a chainsaw. And I was like, should Shaky be using a chainsaw? Because we call him Shaky. I, well, I call myself Shaky. Yeah, so that's how I started it. And then I said, uh, I go, well, you know, just got to keep And I head. asked him not to cut a certain tree. And I did it anyway. He did but it anyway. I knew anyway. it wasn't going to be a problem because it's the way it was. Anyway, it's fine. <laughs> okay. And it does look better, doesn't it? It does but look better. But I had better. to stop because, again, the pain in the back was bad. But it was just, it was just, phys- just so I got to get myself in. in well, more- you haven't done anything in a long time, so your body's out of shape, so it's got to take a, a slow I know, walk. I, I, I get that. Well, I used to be able to go all day long working outside without, right. without a problem. Like, how you used to mow your lawn in 100 degrees with humidity, is yeah. 100%. I mean, I don't know how you did that. Now I can't. 
No. It's too hot. I think as you get older, I think your body changes, and I think you have um, difficulties well, I'm dealing menopause. with the heat. I'm menopause. Okay. Anyway, but uh, I had a good week considering that I've been off track, but I yeah, did I lose a, three I pounds. Week. So I'm back to where I originally uh, was when we started all this. Um, and that's because I've been a little bit better with eating. That's our cat trying to get in. That's our cat trying to get in. He doesn't like and to be left he alone. He doesn't like to be left alone. And um, other things that I did. But I still have not gotten on track. It's it's I'm still having, because I know, you know, because of working out that I do walk, with work and walking, things like that. Do the house cleaning that I, I do because I never sit down. I know I can get back on track. I just got to get back with the points and paying attention because I know if I do all that, I will lose the weight that I want to lose. I just, for some reason, ever since I stopped like around well, the first week it, in December, I just cannot get out. Everything's a habit. So you have, yeah. you have you develop bad habits. Yeah, and I was eating almost the same things every day and that kind of got boring, which if you're on a diet, you shouldn't eat the same things every you're day. You're eating eggs every day. I was, eating, I was Well, because eggs are zero points. So... I try to eat a lot of fruits and vegetables. But today, for, you know, for lunch, I had mango and strawberries as my fruit. The mango ate my And then baby. I had a patty, a hamburger patty. And then for breakfast, I had my toast. I always have toast. I don't know why. Um, and then for lunch, dinner wasn't that bad. So what I got to do is not eat at night, late at night, and, and eat the garbage that we have. Because you always bring up all the candy. I don't. I try not to. But uh, anymore, no more Fritos but and jelly bean this is. I wish I had a picture to show you guys. My, my man... You, it is nightstand. So you are better. You are better. He still loves his candy. Um, you, I, I love my candy. You do love your candy. But I remember pulling out your drawer, the top drawer, and you had at least 20 different things of candy in your drawer. Yeah, which upset Zach because I, when I <laughs> yes, stopped there, because right. he knew where the stash was, and he would go up there and, and pull it out and go, Papa. Yeah. I go, sure, you can have a few of them. Because right. their parents are little... Well, their parents are, you know, they're funny about... Uh, which is fine. Candy. Which is good. Which is, which is smart. Right. It's Okay. So anyway, but... But I'm a papa, and I don't have to go by the same rules. No, you don't. We talked about that Which before. Which we talked about before. But uh, you... So you are better. You don't have... And also, you don't have your trough. Remember that time you had a bowl of all your... Mike and Ike's good and plenty. Well, I used to put... I get... Because uh, when our daughter lived here, our oldest daughter lived here, she likes candy too. And, yes. But she she would she would go in there and attack it. But then I put hot tamales in it. She doesn't like them. No, she doesn't like hot so tamales. So she, she would get mad and... and it would de- it would deter her. Yes. So you would have your your bowl of, of five or six bags of, of whatever candy you buy would be right. in there. It was quite quite hilarious. So what what I have done though is uh oh yeah that's right you bought some new we got Rocco's some up. buy any toxin infusion drink I so I tried one of these it wasn't I, bad I, I tried it I don't know, I know these are great for you but eventually if people out there think they're good for you if they're not good for you you can send us a message saying hey stop drinking those for me if you're like me let me know if you jack. I don't drink sugary drinks. I don't. I drink um, water or unsweet tea, um, which is a problem here. I, I get more sweet tea than I want to get out here. And, and my son does a great a great imitation of me getting sweet tea. But anyway, sweetie, sweetie. <laughs> anyway, but this I listen to that. You know, I'm gonna try this with you, Jack, because it has only one gram of sugar, five calories. It has no official, no artificial sweetener. But it was sweet for me. I it was too sweet. But you had the clementine. Maybe that was the reason why it was sweet. Yeah, it wasn't. It wasn't bad. I liked. It. I, get, I got it really cold. Uh huh. And then I drank it that way. But also, I used to drink aloe vera all the time. Yeah, straight. I don't I know how you drink the aloe vera. Well, I found straight. these things. It's aloe, aloe, and it's aloe twist, twist strawberry lime, and it wasn't bad. And but it has chunks of al- aloe. It has a chunk, aloe, right? what is it? It has a chunk of aloe vera in it, and it has a thing on the back that says uh, goodness from inside out. What do you get when you mix aloe vera, strawberry lime, and altones? Question mark. The twist. Twist, twist. So anyway, we're positive you'll <laughs> agree that after just one sip, your taste buds will smile wide enough to make your body and mind sing. Woo! So that's where you Did it make your body and mind sing? Yeah, I no. Because you don't dance. I don't dance. I don't sing. I don't do any of that you stuff. You sing. I like the singer. I like the Muna and the Juna and, and the, the Springer. <laughs> but no, I, so I tried that one, so I'm going to try them both and try and get more water into me and less Coke, less soda. If I can do that. Well, it's going to take your time because like you said, there was a time you didn't drink any sodas at all and you, you'll do it. You have great willpower. You have probably the best willpower, better than me. Um, but once you get your mindset on something, you do really well. Yeah, it's just a matter of getting that. Yeah, and I think anybody that's starting anything, you know, whoever's starting, you know. And I'm not going to give up completely. No, 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 no. Just, you can't have two or three, and I was, I'm not, I'm back up to like three a day again. I'm sorry, and that's just that. that's just stupid. Yeah, it is. That's just dumb. It is dumb. That's okay though. Anyway, 
But that's all we got. So going into the third week. We're going to go. I'm, gonna, I'm hoping to lose a pound this week. What I'm, would you hoping to lose? At least a pound or two. Okay. I'm going to start walking with Ava every day. Okay. Uh, maybe take both grandkids out on... Well, can I take them both on? No, you don't no, have two strollers. I don't have two strollers. I don't have... Well, somebody would give us back our... Oh, it's broken. Our... Wagon. We Our had a wag- wagon. We had, had a wagon. Seats. Yes. So they broke the wagon. They broke the wagon. Broke so, the wagon. So anyway. we're off the wagon. So we're off it. Anyway. <laughs> well, that's all we got. Again, we appreciate all the support. We appreciate everybody who's sharing these videos and all that different stuff. And we appreciate just taking the time to listen to us and enjoy it. But if you guys have, again, if you have suggestions or if you've joined us and you said, okay, I, I, I've lost a few pounds here. I, I, I'm feeling better. I'm, I'm doing better. Just in general. But know that, you know, sometimes it's okay you're going to not... Do the straight and narrow. You're gonna have you're, you're gonna, gonna have, have bad, bad weeks. days as long as you start over again. And because like for most of us, these bad habits didn't happen overnight. No, these these bad habits like for me, it's been like six years. Right, I've just wait longer than that. Eight eight nine years of just slowly deteriorating to where I just got right to point where I wasn't doing anything. But that's all I got. That's all we got. Sorry, <laughs> it's all about Jack. Forgot forgot <laughs> you, forgot you were here. Oh, uh, forget no, I mean, me. I, I'm fabulous. I know you are fabulous. Whatever. Anyway, everybody have a good week. We'll see you next week. Hopefully, you have some success. We will have some. We're hoping to have success. Oh, and if you haven't seen our latest uh, grandparent video, oh my gosh, that's right. uh, Grandparents, uh, sick grandkids, and yeah, and siphoning out the the... snot. So we warn people ahead of time that could be gross. But but that's that's all we got. Yeah, thanks, you guys. Have a great week. We'll see you on Monday. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.